bishop. Diamonds on my chest like a bishop. And these lines right here ain't no key. What's up? I know a long time no see, long time no talk, however that goes. But hey, you know what? We're not even going to go much into it. I'm just going to tell y'all why I didn't upload. I didn't upload because I was busy. I have soccer and I have school and I'm the oldest in a house of seven, including my parents. So I'm always busy. I'm always doing stuff. But today it's a Saturday and I decided to film because I was like, finally have time. Um, So today I'm going to be showing y'all a look. Uh, I don't know what really what I'm going for I'm using the Jaclyn Hill Times Murphy palette because um I mean I don't know why not and I uh, I was gonna use the James Charles palette but I don't have a eyeshadow primer now let's just get right into the video I'm gonna prime my eyelids with the Tarte Shape Tape concealer it looks like this this one's in shade tan. <laughs> Then I'm going to go in with the Airspun Loose Face Powder just to set the concealer. this color right here it's like a reddish orangey kind of color and i'm going to apply it right under the transition shade and then i'm going to blend using this brush that comes with it or whatever I'm packing the reddish orangish type of color the one that I just showed y'all I'm gonna use this elf professional eyeshadow brush it's just to pack on like I said and I'm just gonna pack that actually now over the lid as well I'm gonna take the Morphe M441 to blend this out. Now we're gonna cut, well, I'm gonna cut my crease. I'm gonna be using once again the touch shape to conceal. You just need a really thin brush for this.
my finger. Take, I'm gonna take this one right here and apply it where we applied the concealer. Okay, now I'm taking this like little like pencil type brush, like like this one. I'm gonna take these two shades right here and I'm going to apply them in the outer corner. This is the e.l.f. blending eye brush, like looks like this. And I'm just gonna blend the outer corner. purpley brownish type shade with this one right here and I apply a little bit of that on my on outer corner now I'm gonna just continue blending It was my first, I think it is my first actual like tutorial that I film or whatever. Um, I, as you can, as you can tell, I don't even know what I'm doing, but I mean, it's a journey, okay? So y'all are gonna see the ups, the downs, everything, you know? Um, but yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If y'all did, please make sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. And uh, yeah, um, I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.